As you were left hanging at the end of the last episode, we literally did not have tickets to the game and couldn't get in. It was sold out everywhere. It felt horrible. I just figured, oh, we'll go down there. It's an afternoon game. They're never sold out. And for whatever reason, that game just sold out. But this uh, Blue Jay employee came by and I mentioned we don't have tickets. He's like, oh, that's too bad. I actually had extra tickets, but I do have one left. If you want that one ticket, you can take it and you can go in with your son. It was awesome. It was awesome. Let's go, Mason. He had no idea what was going on. He just fed off the excitement. Ah! As soon as I plopped him down, he was off. He stopped at this one point where there was a big mural of the Jays and he just was like, wow. Mason and I want to thank the gentleman who gave us a ticket to go to Mason's first game. Ah! To really commemorate the memory, I wanted to make something. The overall idea for this is the shape of home plate. And I took the sign that he made and cut it up and put it as the backdrop. We can see his little toesies and everything like that where he walked on it. Then I also have multiple snapshots from the game that I want to put on the piece. I bought this little bat for him at the game. Here we go. Put something like that at the top. And I've also got obviously this magical ticket that the guy gave to me. So that has to be on there without a doubt. I am just, I am so happy to be a father. I'm so lucky to have Mason as my son. Uh, I just look forward to more and more memories like this.